Hey guys, what is going on? So today I'm going to continue with the Let's Plays. And I hope something will work out today because I've been waiting all week for it. And you'll find out about that shortly. As you can tell, my oil storage is max, so some of you might know what I'm trying to do right now. And if you take a look around my base, you might see something upgrading. That's, uh, that's quite obvious, I probably just gave it away there. But we're going to upgrade some troops and hopefully we can get level 7 riflemen. So... As you can tell, it's a little laggy on my base. Uh, my computer can't handle all these riflemen. I believe there's over a hundred. So we're gonna finish this lab, and then we're gonna see if we can upgrade. Because from from last night around seven o'clock p.m., I got maxed oil storages. And obviously, um, riflemen don't cost a thousand oil to train. So I haven't attacked anyone, and I haven't even played the game since. And that's why I haven't collected my oil yet. There's still like 30, 40,000 oil in these things, so hopefully we can upgrade the troops because I'm going to finish this with diamonds and then we're going to see if we can upgrade riflemen. Now hopefully don't disappoint me, I hope so. 8 million, okay there we go. So 8 million oil to upgrade to level 7. So as you can tell, 46 plus 6 health and then you get 22 plus 4 damage, which is pretty nice, but 600 oil cost, which isn't too bad. And I also get this amazing skin that's going to show up. So, we're going to train these guys, and in 10 days we're going to see how awesome they look, because it's finally it's, it's finally another skin for these guys. I've been using level 6 riflemen for so long, probably like 6 months by now. So, I'm pretty used to the helmets, that's the only thing that changed, they, they got the ace of spades on their helmets. That's pretty much, that's pretty much the only thing that changed. And uh, before they were green like these guys right here, but now they're going to be interesting because what they what I saw on their Facebook page was somewhat interesting they look nice so we're going to go ahead and start that upgrade and in 10 days that shall be done and now let's collect all my oil I should probably have around 200,000 when I'm done 39,000 in each so it's it's been saving up for a while so 273,000 oil right there so that, that's the chunk and I collected the gold obviously because I don't have a space for well I have plenty of spaces for that so now we're going to do an attack, we're going to find a decent base with good resources, and we're just going to take it out and destroy it so we can get some more oil back. Now, bases like these are kind of funny to me, because somehow there's so much resources here, but if I was Town Hall 9, or well, Command Center 9 in this game, I would, I would get so much more. So that's, that's kind of why I don't like upgrading my Command Center, but I had to, because my base was max except for the walls. And, uh... If, if you have a choice to upgrade your command center or not, I would choose not to because there's so much more you can get from battles that uh, it's it's so worth it if you just hold on and stay for a while. See, this base um, this base is kind of strong. It's got a nice little defense in the middle. It's got nice mortars that could definitely hurt my uh, riflemen. So I'm gonna, I would attack this base. Actually, why not? Let's just do it. I don't care. Uh, I'll attack this base anyway. Let's try to... I think the t yeah the towers can reach. Okay, so we're gonna spawn all the gunners in for no reason. We're just gonna toss them all in the middle. Then we're gonna toss in two bombs. And I don't have any rockets or anything, so it's gonna be a little tricky. So hopefully we, uh, my heroes can do some damage, and then we can put the rest of the bombs in. Hopefully they don't they don't get hit by a mortar. So then they can just oh wow all my ra all my gunners are basically dead. Those pirate towers just ripped them apart. So I didn't put the uh, oh the uh, burst area. I didn't put uh, enough bombs in, so that's definitely going to hurt. Hope we, hopefully we can get this mortar out of the way, so then my guys can steal their resources. Because 800,000 resources plus the 200,000 win of the day, um, that's that's going to be nice. It's, it's going to be about 2 million of resources. So hopefully we can at least take this mortar out. I don't see what... There we go. Finally they're going for it. There's so many mortars though, I have to keep someone just distracted. So this mortar right here, I don't want to touch my rifleman. But then this mortar here is going to hit them. So, uh, it's going to be a loss, but we got 200,000 gold. It's not much at all, but we got some. Enough to upgrade one wall, which is good. So, one wall down. About 248 to go. So, uh, we got 213,000 gold. Not too bad, not too bad. I knew we were going to lose that base. The base was pretty strong, and I didn't play my bombs right, so uh, we got wiped out pretty fast. And now let's upgrade a wall. I'm working on this little section right here. 800,000 gold each wall. So, we got a couple done. I, I think like 7, 7 to 9. Um, it's not much, but I've been 
pract I've been trying to get this all week. So I've mostly been going for oil because obviously I wanted to train some troops and uh, I wanted to get that level eight, level seven upgrade on the rifleman. So obviously I did that. And now being that I just upgraded my lab, I believe I can do, nope, can't do preds. Okay, that's, that's heartbreaking. At least I can do pyros, it's seven million. And I can do gunners again, which is also seven million. So when this is done, I shall continue with the gunners. Uh, that's seven million oil, that's, that's not too much. And then I will do that. And then slashers, possibly, that's six million, that's not too much. Um, it's even less than gunners, which I'm surprised about. So I might, I'll probably do that as well. And then Iron Storms, I, I'll definitely do once I get around to it. And the Mosquitoes, I definitely will because I want to attack with those. And then Invaders, I definitely will because I love Invaders. And getting level 3 Invaders is going to be insane. So I'm going to do that as well. And then once I can, I'm going to upgrade the Preds. I think that's next uh, next one. Level 9 Lab required. I believe this is 8. So 8 million oil down. And then we can get this. So... That's pretty much it for this video. It was a short little video, but I wanted to uh, do a quick attack. We got 200,000 gold, which was nice. It was it was good, but zero oil, so I don't really care about that part. But it was a decent battle, and I knew we were gonna lose. And, uh, I knew we were gonna lose, so I didn't really care too much. But I just wanted to get as much loot as possible, and we got pr uh, a good amount of it. So that's pretty much it. And we also upgraded uh, level seven troops, so hopefully we can get that. Oh well, not hopefully. We are gonna get that in ten days. So hopefully I can spend some diamonds on it, uh, hopefully speed up the process so then I can show you guys a video on that. And uh, that's pretty much it. So thanks for watching and have a nice Christmas.